What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Vaughn Taylor First. You already know we do that JJK every Fridays, man. You already know. If you're new to the channel and now you know it, I hope you like, comment, subscribe. Please help your boy out. I know you hear that from every YouTuber, but we got to say it because we got to get out there in the algorithm. I want more people to talk to about these series. Eventually, I want to start a Discord community so I can talk to all of y'all. You know what I'm saying? About different series and different stuff in general. So, yeah. Um... But last chapter specifically, I really liked it because we got Kenjaku talking to Nori Toshi Kamo. He was basically saying, I'm the head of Kamo clan now, so you're done, son. Your goal is, is dead, it's dead, it's, it's gone, it's gone, all right? And he was saying how he was like running shit in the Jujutsu headquarters, essentially, like oh, the higher ups. Um, and yeah, he was just talking this shit to Nori Toshi. So Nori Toshi Kamo obviously can't be the head of the family no more, so he kind of just... I'm just gonna go by Noritoshi now. Fuck a comma. I'm not. I'm not really a comma no more. Cause I mean, if anything, I'm. I wasn't even like, like strictly uh, a child through like marriage or nothing like that too. So you know, what I'm saying he, he out the picture right there. And also he was like uh, Kenjaku was saying how I think he had killed the person that sent out the execution on Itadori, or he wanted to kill the person that did it or something like that, right? And uh, it's funny because he's a W mom right there. That's some W mom shit right there. Kenjaku is a really great mother in anime. You know what I'm saying? Number one mom right there. Protecting her son. His, her son, Yuji. You know? right. Anyway, though, uh, we fast forward later on in the chapter. We've seen the cursed spirit that speed blitz Maki. And apparently it was Naoya Zenin. So he comes back. Obviously, you have to kill. When it comes to Jujutsu, you have to use Jujutsu to kill somebody. But if you kill them like with just brute strength or anything that's not jujutsu, they can come back as a vengeful spirit. So that's how Naoya came back. And I remember, if I remember correctly, it was when Maki's mom stabbed him in the back with that blade without, you know, curse energy or no jujutsu to it. So that's why that happened. And he is back right now as a vengeful spirit. So let's see what's going to happen in this next chapter, man. Chapter 192. We almost had 200. So let's get into it, though. Her Itadori's previous death was self-inflicted. At the Kyoto Goodwill Festival a long time ago, what should you keep in mind when killing another sorcerer? Okay, so we're going back to that conversation that they had back in the uh, Kyoto Goodwill Festival event thing when uh, um, Gaku Ganji was talking to the students of Kyoto, right? Kamo? Yes, to prevent them from turning into a curse after death, we must kill them with Jujutsu. Exactly. Makes a lot of sense. What the fuck is this panel right here? This... This man, Gege Akatame, what are you doing? You trying to do a horror manga right here? This is some night fear fuel right here. Like, what the hell is that? That boy Naoya looking crazy as hell. I mean, he is a vengeful spirit, but it still look crazy. He's all mutilated and bleeding and smiling and shit. This is some weird shit right there, boy. I should have expected this. I have no curse energy, so I simply punched him to death. So... Of course he would become this. I wasn't thinking. I thought her mom... I thought it was because of her mom, though. Because if that's the case, then that means that everybody else will probably come back. But then again, she killed her father with the... With the you know, with a weapon. With a cursed weapon. Um, I think she did that to everybody else, too. I don't think she punched every... Yeah, I think he was the only one that she punched. Like, for real, for real. I don't know, though. Oh no, it's not like that. The one who killed me was Maki Chan's mother. Okay, so we got. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Boom. Okay. I was a little confused right there. How? Oh, <laughs> this is so fucking creepy. I wonder how his voice will sound. I can't wait till we get to this point because I always like to hear the cursed spirit's voices because I always tell it like distorted and creepy and, you know, like Rika and, um, yeah, just Rika really. There's some other ones too, but mostly Rika. How could, uh, you couldn't possibly, possibly, possibly be shaken. How shocking. I've come to kill you, all right? If you can't take care of your own feelings, what makes you think you can beat me now? Hey, now, oh yeah, I ain't gonna lie. You have to chill the fuck out, boy. Okay, Noritoshi shot an arrow at him. Noritoshi gun. I detest that curse technique. <laughs> that's that, that's that, that's that clan fighting right there. You said, boy, fuck your little... Y'all a little curse technique, man. Fuck that, boy. Hell no. Fuck. It's all about Zenin clan around here. Fuck a combo clan. That's <laughs> basically what he said. Nice assist, but that shot, that one better just be instinct. At least it didn't hit you. Unlike Maki, I can easily deduce his location from his presence. And that boy is shooting from a distance. Boy going crazy. His arrow's going crazy. I like that paneling right there. Boy, Naoya's trying to dodge. He look so ugly. <laughs> Man, 
Maki coming up to him. Who like she? I think she slashed at him. I think he jumps back. Oh no, she slashed. She. I think she. She. She got him. Yeah, she. She fucking him up. <laughs> Damn. He looks so goddamn weird and creepy though. That shit's crazy. Ugh. Yeah, she slashed the fuck out of him. Did we do it? Seemed like even cursed spirits feel pain. I've exercised so many of them. Did uh wait? I've I exercised so many of them. Did all of those little ones feel pain like this? I'm sorry. I deeply apologize. Damn, he's flying up. Hmm. That's interesting for him to say. I've exercised so many of them. Did all of those little ones feel pain like this? I I'm sorry. I deeply apologize. Is he being like genuine about that? Yeah, never mind. I don't know why I fell for that shit, boy. But that boy, no, he ain't shit. Why the hell did I fall for that? He said, psych, as if I care. He said, psych, I lied. <laughs> Ugh. Is he, like, regenerating? Ugh. A reaction to being destroyed. No, wait, that shape is... I knew it. Shoot. Shoot it, Noritoshi. It's a curse wound. Oh, fuck, yeah. What the fuck? He's going to complete to complete his transformation. Okay, that's cool. I didn't... I mean, it makes sense for him to look all crazy like that, but I was like, yeah, that... He looks so... Just, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, change, change your form a little bit. Uh, boy. <laughs> Damn. He shot right through it. Piercing blood right through it. But I feel like he's going to miss, though. It is a big ball. He probably is going to miss. It went through, though. It went through like shit, though. <laughs> Thank goodness we managed to exercise him at this stage. I don't think y'all did. He was that fast already as a curse form. If he'd complete his form, then just what would exactly look at him. But yeah. Noritoshi, oh, fuck, oh, no, he's about to punch the shit out, no, I don't even know what went on, did he, I mean, he punched him, okay, he's punched him, like, through, like, trees and shit, right, I thought he was gonna punch through him or something and kill him, so good, good, he's not, he, he didn't, he didn't do that, I didn't want to see him die, like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, trash, read the room, will you, no, he yeah. evolves, Okay, this form is still creepy, but I, I like it better in terms of in, if I'm comparing it with the other one. Interesting, though. Like, he punched the fuck out of him, though. I ain't gonna lie. He punched the shit out of him. Um, yeah. That boy looking crazy, though. Okay, so that's the chapter right there. Um, good fighting. It's good to see Noritoshi in the field fighting, doing his thing. On the blood technique and all that. Maki and Naoya just fighting and shit. Obviously, they're going to finish this up pretty soon. I would assume because, I mean, Maki's just a monster. So she's obviously going to get the upper hand. But I like this, though. It's, it's different. It kind of reminds me of, like, Bleach. Like, with the hollows, whenever, um, like, it reminds me of, um, what was his name? The one that killed Ichigo's mom. Grand Fisher, right? It reminds me of Graham Fisher, I think that's his name. When he had like, when you can see his face and he was looking basically like a Iran car, right? You can see his face. He was just looking kind of crazy. You know what I'm saying? I liked how that looked. Like it was creepy as shit and just weird. But yeah, it kind of reminds me of that a little bit. But yeah, dope fight in this chapter. I wonder how they're going to finish this off. That boy Kamo really got punched like, like that. Like, yeah, he fucked him up. <laughs> But yeah, man, let me know down below how you guys felt about this chapter, my reaction, all that good stuff. You guys already know, man. And stay tuned for more videos. You already know I always upload every goddamn week as long as I'm healthy and all that stuff. So, like I always say at the end of the videos, please stay safe, stay healthy, and stay clean. See you guys on the next video.